they were it was an interesting one because they were implying that their opponents in the quarterfinals, they come up, I'm not going to look at them, I promise. <laughs> I'm not sure how genuine that, uh, that was. Perhaps that's a little unkind. That verbalise yeah. the information as opposed to hand signals. Yeah, he's made that. Like it was long all the way, didn't it? Must have just dipped in time, electronic. Yeah, level of the tennis and the, the power of the hitting, as you were touching on, Mark. It's pretty good. Salisbury looking sharp early on. He is six foot three. And imagine the wingspan as well. Mariano Hood, he is the fellow that is leading the Colombians at the moment. As you saw, Mariano and Mariano saying that the, the boys were just trying to find some, some confidence that uh, had been a bit of a, a barren run. Oh, brilliant doubles. And again, the movement, athleticism. Court coverage there. Well inside Rajiv's half of the court, and then teams very little separating them. Slightly different format on tour, of course, with a, a Champions tiebreaker in place of the final set. So we've had a 10-3 breaker, 10-6 breaker, 11-9. It was 2021, the Nito ATP finals, and back end of last season, and uh, they played one to disappear. If it's a forehand return or a backhand return. Two elements that are, have been communicated, serve direction, and, and then what the netman is, is doing. There's nothing else, is there? That, yeah. What type of serve and where I'd like him to go. Teams these days, they, it seems to be more of the net person. Oh, you're kidding me. I can only assume that was an issue with the sun. Yeah. Three having to take his time on an overhead, but have a look, he's he almost ducked. He was trying to get under it to see that, and he, he must be just totally blind. Bonus for Raman Salisbury. <laughs> and Salisbury directing the lob to Farah, who was the one that uh, had an air swing on. Misses the first often enough, that second opponents have the chance to get on top of it. And there's the difference with the, the first serve. He's able to just slide it around the, the box there. Oh, the body line approach and it worked. The first return was able to confuse Farah. He was still moving. Brilliant points from all four.
good quality. Yeah, there was nothing wrong with the serve. The return was decent as well. Farah, great job in getting involved. All four really involved in that point, and that's a very polished volley by Cabal. They both, all four, have featured in mixed doubles draws over the last number of years. Plenty of time to actually set himself up for a forehand or backhand, but that was quite the deliberate tweener. Great reactions by Rahm and Salisbury. Staying alive, just making sure that they... Not bad in doubles, a 15-shot rally. And the next couple of strikes, you can see the return was good quality. That's a, a tough drive volley. That, that forehand side, that's the weaker, more vulnerable side of... This time he got hold of the return, but again, good enough from the Colombians. Over the years, that they used to play best of five sets here. It was five sets from the first round, then it was reduced to five sets from the quarterfinals onwards. I went, I believe it did go to uh, maybe just the final one year of best of five. Third round, there were nine singles main draw players. And it's just, in my, my opinion, it's just not enough. Yes, it's good, good to see. It's a nice return. Oh. Just out of the reach. The first set tie break. What a start to the game that was. He was able to fend it off of his body. Oh, it's another one. For the number one seeds. He made that. I think he has. What a time! Uh, the top seeds make their move. Continue to make returns. I think it was like three winners, outright winners, off the return of serves by Rama Salisbury. That is a factor that the Colombians weren't able to fend off. Consecutive US Open final. Keep the point alive. There was a bit of safety in the point played, executed by unsuccessful on that first break. Next one disappears quickly. This is what can happen with Ram. He can send down some first serves to the corners. Goodness 
knee, they were bearing down on the net. Oh, the forward movement of Farr, that was proactive. Top class. Oh, break point two. In between first and second serves. He's able to just hold on long enough. It was alerted. Her. Really good hold of serve, particularly when you cast your mind back to that. Certainly when it comes to back end of tournaments and big moments. Just compact return by Joe Salisbury there. He doesn't back away from the baseline. Good wins in the finals with Karlovic and Quarry. Final overhead just coming around the outside of the ball. Cabal exploring the width of the court and out past the extended hand of Ram. Oh. Quite get hold of the return. Rajiv then provides the signals. Yeah, it's a great angle. You can see the serve. Good look at Ram up at net there. Oh, hello. Centered that oh, again, it's Raji Ram with some heroics up at the net. How's he fended that one off? That, the, the racket head was actually pointing down to the ground. Another backhand return. So is that serve? Me might have to start changing it up. Seems like that body backhand serve Cabal is starting to like. Fifth break point of the second set. This is it this time, and the Colombians make a move. Goodness me. That was a well struck return. Some frustration. He's just lost his serve, and as we said, the crowd are starting. Deal with here for the top seeds. Just lost the momentum. Opponents raised their games. The crowds getting involved. 
Colombians caught side the reaction of their opponents as well. Body backhand, so it really. Yeah. An early game and a half, maybe, of this second set but the Colombians have responded and it's been a, a bit of a lively one to officiate this oh nice world class vision feel execution or first right see the gap on the court so, uh... it's improved but the Christmas of cabal he's had to Play a few of these volleys on the Farah service games, not just in this one. Beautiful return. Looks like he is playing from the middle. Rajiv, just to throw that lob up down the line because they've got to contend with the shadows as well. Um, has to play, unable to get it over the net. Little Colombia inside Armstrong comes to life once more. And it is game on in this first men's doubles semi final. <laughs> Polish team, they've beaten three sets. That second set slipped away. It was a bit of a heartbreaker, as well. I mentioned at the start of the match. They had four match points at 5 4 in the second set. Rugged opponents, as well as the, the vocal crowd. A second serve that he ended up putting into play, but the first serve. A couple of very good holds from the defending champions and top seeds. Numbers looking good on serve already in this third set. Six out of seven first serve points. One couple. Positive start. Beautiful. Threaded up the line. With the return, he was able to again direct it over towards the doubles alley. Cabal 
extended his arm. He didn't. That's the ball for now. The return of serve, but Lee, I give a lot of credit to the gutsy second serve. 96 miles per hour. Good game from the juice court. That he is. That was clean as well. Made sure that are up at net. So he can find some open court here. Shank. And again, the second serve thumped down. 111 miles per hour. Two more here now for the top seeds. Choosing to let that one bounce and just restart, reset. Good test of a player when you do face that sort of adversity in a, a big game, big set, big stage, of course. Grand Slam semi finals, but he uh, got things back on track pretty quickly. the last time that he served in this set. It's rock solid. Yeah, you can see Farah there giving himself some space behind the serve. And then when the ball comes by him at the moment of contact, it's going to be interesting to see whether he has the same level of braveness. the first serve that's a, a bonus it's been uh, lively that's for sure court side <laughs> off it's been in the perfect position to just knock off the volley and again Teaming up beautifully. Oh, it's a great game. Such a bonus when you can just race through one of those service games. Robert Farah has to hold serve to keep them in the tournament. Drive from Cabal will orchestrate from the middle of the court.
the game on serve. Didn't allow the top seeds any kind of. Absolutely brilliant off the backhand return. Well, we could see as they were setting up for this game that Mariano Hood, the coach of Cabal Farah, just having, you know, the two handed backhand. This court 6 5 serving for a place in the title decider. And what a start from Salisbury. Ice cool. That's pretty special. Make the return and then a quality. Really put a, a foot wrong in this game, Cabal Farah. It, it's been the quality returns. Thank you. Salisbury fending off some tough returns. And they do break, and on we go. Well, perhaps this is what being number one, the number one team. A tie break to settle this. First to ten points. <laughs> Quickly, they've played four deciding breakers. Champions tie breaks. What a response. Fooled him. This is going to be hard for our crew to try and put a, a package of highlights together. Starting to come thick and fast here at Turn back into play. Oh, that's quite extraordinary. And again, Farah couldn't have played a, a better point. He did what was asked of him. Seeing the previous point, Para though in that beautifully tucked. The defending champions move on. They've survived a thriller of the semi-final inside Armstrong.
were just a little bit too tough in that deciding shootout. And they really did a wonderful job of staying focused and maintaining self-belief on the Colombian serve for victory deep in the third. Joe Sosby, Rajiv Ram, return to the US Open final.